recording. Can you still hear me? Yes, I can. All right, good. So don't switch the camera around because that's what that might be what happened when you switched the camera around before. It um, kicked the microphone out. Okay. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, it's the beer butt chicken cook off time. <laughs> this is my chicken. We have Frank Rusek over there in North Carolina with his chicken. As you can see, that's his chicken there. He's got his prepared with some, is that olive oil? Yes, olive oil in there, yes. Wow. All right. So that's a pretty small pigeon. How are you going to get the beer can up its butt? Well, well, you see, I did have a seven pounder, but it was kind of too big. So then I went and bought a smaller one, and this is what it came out to be. So, oh, so well. I my little chicken. So what's your plan? Are you going to be putting any seasoning on your uh, pigeon? Yeah, I have a mixture of uh, of Italian seasonings, garlic powder, onion powder, cayenne pepper, and then I got some uh, kicking and chicken over there I'm going to use. I'm going to rub it all with some uh, olive oil first to get it all on there so it helps the seasoning stick on there. Oh, well, that sounds like you've been... Um... You've been prepped by somebody else, right? Uh, no, it's just called this little thing called the YouTube. <laughs> YouTube. <laughs> well, I, got a little, I got a little bit of uh, smoked paprika, sweet smoked paprika. So I'm just going to put that into a little bowl. Just a little bit. Because I haven't prepared my seasonings yet. Yeah, I got so that's... That's how much paprika I'm putting in there. And then I'm going to add some pepper steak, which is just a little bit of pepper. And I'll add some Italian seasoning, but, or Italian herbs. I'm not going to do any more. That's all I'm going to put on there because um, Summer and Parker don't like a lot of, of heat. Just gives it a little bit of flavour. Now I haven't put olive oil in mine yet. So just mix that around. All right. Yeah. Them up. What'd you say? These them all up. I'm going to put the olive oil all in over the chicken there. I'm going to do what you did. And then I can put all the seasoning on there. Yours looks good. Oh, I'll put some of this chicken, chicken stuff on here. I hope this thing holds up with this beer can. <laughs> you know, it's the first time ever doing one of these. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I've ever done it either, to be honest. Yeah. Yeah. Anybody going? I think it'd be done. I'm going to stick it up there. Oh, yeah. Fits nice. Oh, you got it, you got it up there already? Yeah, because see, my chicken is small. Fit nice in there, but I got I got a small chicken, you know. You got a bigger chicken. Now the bigger chicken I had earlier would have been nice. But so, what kind of beer did you put in there? The Blue Moon. Blue Moon beer. Yeah, Blue Moon. It's got a tangerine uh, flavor. Frankie said too. It tastes good. See, I don't drink, so I don't know nothing about the beer. I was going to use Budweiser, but. Uh, I've got Great Northern original. So this is uh, full strength, full strength beer. <clears throat> um, I can't waste it. So what is it? It's uh, 10 minutes to 7 o'clock in the morning. So cheers. Okay, cheers.
I don't drink, so you you have some fun with your cheers. Yeah, it's not enough. Did you just put a half a can in there? That's like three quarters. Half a can, three quarters. Three quarters. Yeah, all right. Three quarters of a can there. All right, well, because uh, it's a chicken and it's going up its butt, I'm just going to put some olive oil all over the can. <laughs> yeah, like I said, well, I have a small chicken. So I just want to grease it up before I stick it in there. All right, bird, here we go. You get in, okay? Wee, ee, 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 ee. <laughs> All right. You got it? Yep, she's in there. And yours is standing up. Yeah. He's standing Mine proud. Is too. How good's that? He's standing proud chicken. Hang on, I just need to quickly wash my hands. Mine's standing up too. Well, it's leaning over a little bit though. What I might need to do is I might need to um, might need to tie these wings in. I'm gonna let him try to stand proud there. So he does it for me. Well, it 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 seems to be just sitting there quite nicely, actually. Yeah, they sit pretty good on that can. Looks good. Might just leave it alone. Well, yours looks good. So you're putting yours into the grill now. I've got mine. I've already heated up my oven. I get it. Yes, we're going to cook our chickens. See how they turn out. I hope it turns out okay. I hope it stays standing up. So how long are you, are you closing the lid on that? Yes. And you reckon you're going to cook it for about an hour and a half, eh? Yeah, as the duck's saying, an hour and a half. Sweet. All right. Well, let's cook away and we'll come back to the broadcast when it's all done sounds good to me we'll see how our chickens come out how long for your chickens be about chicken all right we'll see you in a little while Rattle. right ladies and gentlemen it's time to bring the chickens out we're going to see how the chickens are gone from frank from outback outlaw Gonna bring you into the chat, Frank. Uh, you going, Frank? Yeah, okay. Let me turn this camera around again. Right, you can hear me, Frank. Yeah, I can hear you. You can hear me. Is that your chicken? That is my chicken. <laughs> what, what are you laughing at? Look at that chicken. <laughs> Did you uh did you did you order well done? Yes. I, I guarantee it's gonna be nice and tender inside. <laughs> oh man, Lord. Check mine out, just come out of the oven. What's so funny? It's it's a good cooked chicken. I don't know why you're laughing. I, I saw some black bits there. What were the black bits? This is just part of his leg, see? It just comes off. Well, I'll get him yeah. <laughs> Look at it. He's nice and moist inside here. Nice and moist inside. Well, you're going to have to put it on a plate and you're going to have to cut it open. We're going to have to see for ourselves. Look at that can. Comes out nice and easy. Oh, far out. All right, check mine out, Frank. Oh. 
Are you trying to That's steal mine, mine? No, he's got to get the breast. See the breast over That's here. That's his back. Huh? Flip it. Flip it. You see that? That's his breast. These are his breasts. Well, how good is that, eh? Hey, 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 hey. Wait till you see what it looks like inside. I'm looking forward to that. Are you? Yeah, yeah. Show it to everybody else. Everybody else thinks it's not moist. Look at that moisture in there. <laughs> hey, laugh. Watch. Where's Sandy in this? Is she watching this? She's, Do we have yeah. witnesses? She's behind the camera. Look, look at that. It's just the seasoning that, that hurts. What's the moisture it's like? Little, it's a little bit dry. A little bit just dry. a little bit dry? You can see it. Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm going to cut mine up there. Right, let's see. It's still, it's still hot. very hot. Oh, it's delicious. Yeah, right. Taste it. Look, I'm lying. You Tastes like, good. Like... Oh, wow. The bones, the, the meat just oh, comes off the bone. Look at that, Frank. Let the meat's see. just coming off the bone. I didn't even have to cut it. Well, this guy just needs a little um, barbecue sauce. Oh, wow. <laughs> That's because you basted yours. Frank just left it in the grill with no joint juice. No joint. No joint. So uh, Frank just put it straight in there and didn't take the, uh, and didn't baste it with the juices. Right. Kind of how he does. Oh, I have no juices. Look. That's kind of how he grills these. There ain't no juices. Throws it in there and whips it for us. Yeah. <laughs> it's a little, it's a little dry. You see what the can was. Uh, you gotta, you gotta watch this uh, operation of trying to get the, the can out. No, the bum. Can out. There you go. Wee, wee. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Ah. That, cool. that. Almost, that almost needs to be edited out. Man. Actually, it, oh, actually, it's not. That. It's not dry. No, it's not bad. It's dry. Wow. Man. Doesn't that look that, good? Try that wing, Dad. See if you get the meat off that wing there. Sandy, I want you to try that chicken and tell me what it tastes like. It, I know. It's not bad, actually. It's probably the most moist chicken he's ever made. Bad. See, look at that chicken. Not bad. Mine was bad. Show the other side of the wing, Dad. It's a little crisp. Kind of tough, coming apart. Little crisp. I made seven pounds. Just breaks off. <laughs> You're a snap. I mean, it breaks off like yours. You know, yours was uh... a. <laughs> Just get a cut through mine. She's used to that, though. Look at Sophia. Get her. She wants some chicken. That little Jeff up there. Come down on her, Mom. Wow, this is just falling apart. We don't want some chicken. Spicy, though. Is Spicy? It? Yeah. It's like hot wings. Have you ever seen a Christmas vacation with the big balls where they, uh, the lady cooks the turkey and they cut it open? It's like poof, but it just hey. opens up. That's what we told my dad. See, mine's, mine's made so you can get toothpicks with it. You don't got to get it. <laughs> <Just use this. laughs> See that? But yours don't do that. It looks like it got hit by a car and then fall the fire. Yours looks very good. Not bad. Yeah, it does. What'd you say, Sandy? Looks very good. Oh, well, you know, this is it. Did you use an IPA or just a regular beer? Um, this was a a grain fed chook, actually. So, like the proper kind of chook. I still is what do you say? Is I was it? Oh, oh yeah, look at yours. All nice. Looks good. Nice and juicy. Looks like you made a little bit of a mess. Look at mine. Looks like a roadkill. We could take juice from yours and add to ours and you'd still have enough. <laughs> it looks juicy, though. It's juicy. Oh, I love it. 
<laughs> so what did you learn out of this, Frank? What did I learn about this? Yeah, what did you learn? I don't cook like Sandy does. Get some fried egg, man. <laughs> How, how's the leg, Sam? He's good at fried egg. He's a good breakfast cooker. Thank God I cook tonight, though, huh? Why? Your breakfast There's cooker, no but you don't cook like Sandy. Seven pounder, I think he's been fine. That's all right. You have two used to eating dry meat. That's all right. Put on a sandwich with some mayonnaise, and you'll be good. Oh, no. no, that's the toothpick. It's, it's, thank God I, I cook tonight. So he's, he's going to use bones, ladies and gentlemen. He's going to use the bones as toothpicks to get the chicken meat <laughs> out of his mouth. Um, do you have any bones left, or are they all completely charred? I want to. I want to see the leg. I want to see the leg. Show me the leg. Right here. One is one yeah, side the, is moist. The end that you the end that you're right. holding, Frank. The end that you're holding. I want to see that bit. See where the leg? Where, where that's where it stood up. <laughs> 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 I love it. <laughs> this where awesome. it stood up on there. It stood by itself. I'll eat it. And it's it's still pretty it's still pretty uh, moist. Did you say? Yeah, it's still moist. Now I made mine in the oven in the house for seven pounds. He made a three and a half pound. Mm. I made mine in, in my oven in the kitchen, and it was so amazing. Wow. Well, you see, this, this is, is still, really nice. still like I say, it's still moist. Or you put on a sandwich with some mayonnaise or some something like that, help it out a little bit. Some gravy. It's gonna help out a lot, actually. <laughs> if you put mayonnaise with it. Yeah, but Frank, that that I looks, bet your wings don't look like that. Don't don't chew that. I don't want you to choke to death. Look at that wing. It breaks right off. Watch. Well, see, back in the old days, charcoal, they used to use charcoal to clean people's teeth. So you can you can actually feed yourself and wash your teeth at the same time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the way I do it. That's a really good technique, actually. You should uh, learn from that, Sandy. Okay. Gotcha. Dan, that was good. I'll make sure I eat all this. Look at that. Nice and moist, see it? Still wet. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, folks. There you go. I know, You've got... not, I know it's not as good as yours tonight, but next time maybe I'll use my seven pound bird. Yeah, next time it's ribs. Four... No, I ain't doing no ribs. Oh, no. ribs next time, eh? Ribs. Yeah, you'll probably get me on the ribs because you Americans are good at doing that stuff. No, not me. All right, so so it's, <laughs> so it's going to be. It's, he can do something with his native uh, Australian. Well, the next cook off will, will be me and Summer. We'll do spare ribs. Spare ribs, you and Summer, done. Yeah. All right, folks. That was Frank Rusek doing his beer butt chicken. <laughs> um, he well and truly roasted that one. Um, but good on you, mate. Well done. There's Outback's chicken right there. Thank you very much, yeah. everybody, for Outback. joining in and watching. You did, you did good, Outback. You did great, man. The master chef. Master chef. Okay, All right, body. guys. Now, now we'll have to see. Now we'll have to see what everybody thinks. You know, my blowtorch chicken or yours. <laughs> <laughs> and hopefully, I get to be able to be able to do this for the premiere because I've never done one before. So. We'll see how we go. I had to download a free music uh, movie editor for the laptop, so we'll work it out. Okay. So, all right, guys. Thanks very much. Thanks for joining in. You're welcome. Thanks for the laugh. Have fun. Cool.